One of the really coolest things in 3D printing right now are these kits. They, there's parts. There's parts that you get and then you 3D print the rest of it and then you put it together. Back in the day, you'd go to the hobby store and you'd buy a box. And the box would be a bunch of plastic parts that you'd put together and then you could add stuff to it. So instead of that, you go to a store or an online store and you get parts like electronics and connectors and wires and stuff. And then you go to a website and you download models and you 3D print those and then you've got yourself a product. And I've done this before. Look, these are the Hedamame headphones and I absolutely adore these. I love the look. I love how they sound. It's a premium product that you help make at home. And one of the advantages here is customization. Because if you're gonna print the parts yourself, you get to choose the materials and the colors that you make it with. That's cool, which is why mine, of course, is made with High Five Blue. But the other really cool thing about this is right to repair and repairability. If for some reason the headband breaks or I mishandle some of my gyroid exposed infill, I can reprint the parts, I can fix my product, and I can continue to use it. It's brilliant. Next up, speakers. I'm talking about the FDM Geos from Deposition Sound. And ooh, this was, the this was cool because recently we had our big holiday live stream and Morgan from Hedamame was here and Waldo from Deposition Sound was here and actually they took a picture together, posted it to Twitter, someone commented I could hear this picture. It was just, just that's perfect. But Waldo and Yvonne are Deposition Sound. They make these 3D printable speaker kits that you can acquire. So you get the cool speaker bits and then you 3D print the parts and then you've got yourself a premium product that you get to customize and can repair if for some reason something breaks. And I've printed the parts. Check this out. There you go. Let's 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 go through the parts because because I'm really proud of how these turned out. Uh, you go on the website, uh, you can get the parts from, I know I got them from printables, and I printed them on the Prusa XL and the Prusa Mark IV S. Uh, the ones, oh wait, wait. Can't forget the standoffs there. So first up, on the XL is the body of the FDM Geos. And it's glorious. Just, just look at these. Oh, I used Prusament Galaxy Black, and I think it turned out wonderful. Now, uh, these parts here, these were printed on the Mark IV-S in the same Prusament Galaxy Black PLA, and they also turned out just exquisite. I love these. They're gonna make really cool speakers. These are in Hi-Fi Blue PLA from Protopasta, of course, because this is the customization part. There's this little ring that goes around the inside, and it's this, and so I made it I made it blue, I made it blue. So my speakers are gonna be Galaxy Black and Hi5 Blue. And in order to put these together, uh, I went and looked on the website. It said I needed some tools, and I think I found some tools. So, you know, there's you know, you know, screwdrivers, there's hex keys, stuff like that. Important though, uh, a soldering iron with a heat set tip. You, you can use one of those heat set insert things uh, I think I have one somewhere. I can't find it. So a soldering iron with a heat set insert tip, that's what you need. You also need a pair of wire crimpers. Now, don't use the cutty bits, use the crimpy bits. And Yvonne, I, I texted Waldo and Yvonne, let him know I was gonna do this, and Yvonne said, give it a tug test when you're done. Aye, aye, Captain. Last but not least, it does say, find yourself some cyanoacrylate super glue. How about some 3D gloop? I think that's gonna work. Actually, I talked to Waldo when he was here and I was like, hey Waldo, why don't we use 3D glue? And he's like, that's a good idea, Joel. Thank you. Now I just need the parts and check this out. Deposition Sound sends you a box and it's got a, a sticker with links and stuff to it. And you get, you, get your, you get your foam, you get your tweeters and your feet pads and your posts, some wire, the things to crimp, uh, some screws. Uh, this is the crossover board? I think something like that. And then inside here are the five inch treated paper cone woofers. 
And then um, heat set inserts. Oh, and stickers. And just like that, the speakers are built. But before we test them out, a couple things, just a couple things that we have to go over. One of them is this. <laughs> and it's, it's not this. The threaded heat sets that were included, I didn't have the right tip for. And I was sad and I thought I would have to use the standard soldering iron tip to put them in. And that would have made me really sad. But instead I remembered years ago, Naomi Wu sent me this. This is for putting in heat set inserts. Like you, you set the position properly. The rubber band is what, is what defines the, the force needed. And then you just, you just put it down there and it goes and it sucks it right down. Naomi, I apologize. I don't know if you're ever going to see this, but I apologize for taking so long to put this together. This is an amazing tool. Thank you so very much. I really hope you're doing okay. The speakers, they're done. And they look, oh, these are, these are, okay, I love the blue. I love the blue on it, and I love the Peru Cement Galaxy Black. I think together they are fantastic, just fantastic. Uh, Deposition Sound did an amazing job putting together this kit. I think. The documentation is about 75% there. I'd like to see more images, perhaps more videos. I was able to get it done, but there was some parts where I was slightly confused. Some parts where pictures showed something and the text didn't describe it sort of thing. So I'll provide my feedback to Deposition Sound. It's, it's not bad by any stretch of the imagination. It's actually incredible. The process of putting it together was fun, and I'm so happy they're together. Now to test these properly, well, if you remember last time I 3D printed speakers, years ago, I went to a secondhand store and bought an old receiver. Uh, that was then. Now we've got a better solution, and it's available via Amazon, so check this out. This is the SMSL, high resolution power amplifier A100. This is an amp that you can talk to via Bluetooth. It's perfect. I mean, you can, you can use USB, you can use something else, but here's what I wanted. I wanted the ability to connect with my laptop or my iPhone wirelessly. And it's not expensive. It's about a hundred bucks. I'll put a link down below. I'm, but I'm just, I am stoked. And these, I think this is 25 foot of wire, each one. Normally speaker wire, at least back in the day, speaker wire was kind of expensive. When Waldo was here for the stream, he had this and I learned about it and I bought one and he had these wires and I said, Waldo, are these expensive good or are they good? And he said, they're good. Let me show you. Let me just get it out of the box and show you. Like this is not sponsored. I, I went out and I bought it. Look at that. And I'm gonna plug this in, hook it up, and we're gonna see if we can hear something coming out of these speakers. We're powered on. Let's try. Okay. Yeah. All right, all right. Producer David did send me another one. Oh man. I'm gonna turn down a little bit because I'm so happy. I mean, a speaker that can play it loud is great. They still sound great when they are quiet. Oh, I'm so happy. I'm so, so happy. These are the FDM Geos from Deposition Sound, they're amazing. And they, remember, you get a kit, you 3D print the parts, and then you put it together. I did some things a little different. I used 3D Gloop instead of Cyanoracrylate. Our brand PLA, not Pet G. I think they do Pet G. But listen, I am stoked. I'm stoked, and I really hope 
you come visit because I'll play you some stuff on these. And I, if, if you're interested in getting your own, there's a link down below because what I learned about Deposition Sound, Waldo and his brother, Yvonne, this isn't their full-time gig. This is something that they're passionate about and they wanted to make sure good quality sound was available to people who like to put their things together and they've succeeded. Go down below and click that link and take a look and then go find Deposition Sound on social media and just thank them because these are friggin' amazing. Well, listen, if you made it this far, you're awesome. Don't forget to hug each other more, fight for a cause you believe in, and just listen to all of the quality things. And as always, high five.